So, you want to hear another story, huh? One where the very fate of Pandora hangs in the balance? If not, too bad, I'm telling you anyway. First, there was the vault. An alien prison opened with a mystical key. To the warriors who opened it, the vault was just a container of tentacles and disappointment. They vanished into the wastelands, certain that the vault held no treasure at all. They were wrong. The vault's opening triggered the growth of Iridium, a priceless alien element. Soon, the rare and valuable mineral emerged all across Pandora. Its appearance attracted many, including the Hyperion Corporation. They came to Pandora to mine Iridium and bring order to the savage planet. Through their excavations, Hyperion uncovered evidence of an even greater vault. Their leader vowed to find it, to use its power to civilize the Borderlands, once and for all. But Hyperion weren't the only ones searching for the next vault's alien power. The call of danger and loot is not so easily resisted. Certain warriors came to Pandora in droves to uncover its hidden secrets. Some would call them adventurers. Others call them fools. But I call them vault hunters. Our story begins with them and with a man named Handsome Jack.
Welcome to Pandora, kiddos. Another dead vault hunter. Handsome Jack's been busy. Wait a minute. You're not dead! Yes! Now I can get off this glacier. Claptrap, your metaphorical ship has finally come in. Allow me to introduce myself. I am a CL4P TP steward bot, but my friends call me Claptrap. Or they would, if any of them were still alive, or had existed in the first place. Oh, I've got something for you. Here, take this echo communicator that I totally didn't loot from one of these corpses. It comes with a Class 12 heads-up display, complete with a mini-map. Now, come come, friend. Let's get you inside. Man! This is great! Now that I've met a mighty vault hunter, I can finally join the Resistance in Sanctuary, take vengeance against Jack for killing my product line, and repair my central processor so I stop thinking out loud! I wonder what it's like to have a belly button. I'll explain everything soon, but know this. You're alive for a reason, and I am here to help you. Come on, minion! I'm the Elmo! Thank <laughs> you. 
the gun in the cabinet. Ah! You will be safe. You coming? Ah! I hear bully bots! Sick of minions! Protect me, Squire! Sanctuary, the last bastion of the resistance against Jack, and the only place you'll be truly safe. Get to Sanctuary. Can't help but notice you're not getting me out of here. 
Maybe you're thinking, oh, Claptrap's such a strong and noble paragon of justice and skill, he can get out himself. Which, most of the time, you would be totally right about. But as it stands right now, I can use some help. And if you don't, I'm gonna have to pull out the big guns. I'll hit you with the silent treatment. See how you like that? Yep. Giving you the silent treatment. <laughs> Feel the sting of my passive aggression. Being totally silent. Many thanks, friend of friends. Onward! Hey, kiddo, Jack here, president of Hyperion. Let me, let me explain how things work here. The Vault Hunters show up, Vault Hunter looks for the new vault, Vault Hunter gets killed by me. You see, you see the problem here? You're still alive. So if you could just do me a favor and off yourself, that'd be great. Thanks, Pumpkin. Liarsburg! 
is on the other side of this Hyperion barge. What say we cut through it, chum? Ha! This door's Hyperion tech. Child's play. And open! Knowing you. I hear getting eaten alive by bully box isn't such a bad way to go. Let me get that for you. Executing phase shift. You're welcome. Perks of being an artificial intelligence. I'm networked into almost everything on this planet. It's a long way to sanctuary. Please take whatever you need for the journey ahead. I'm in this location! Minion? Keep your wits about you, minion. This glacier's run by a bandit named Captain Flint. The jerk kept me as his torture play thing for a few months. We play games like dodge the blowtorch and don't get dunked into the pool of acid. I was really good at the first one. Attention, people of Pandora. Handsome Jack here, offering a million bucks to whoever brings me the head of the vault hunter who just arrived in Liarsburg. Oh. And I'm still offering a reward for Roland, the mass murdering leader of the Crimson Ladies. Good hunting, bandits! A million bucks! Alright, boys, this is Captain Flint! I want you to find that vault hunter and bring him to me now! Just follow the soothing sound of my voice! like to deserve this kind of treatment. I say, Vault Hunter, could you kill Flint's men for me? Proposition for you, Vault Hunter. You give up, we'll just shoot you in the head. It'll be quick, clean, and a hell of a lot less painful than what handsome Jack I can't could. believe this. Ah. What is wrong with you boys? Just kill that slag leg so we can. 
can get our reward! You can't handle me! I suppose I am in your debt now, aren't I? Come to my... First, I shall shut off the electrical fence. Please stay back, Vault Hunter. Let Claptrap go first. I knew Hammerlock would come around eventually. Me and him are like two peas in a pod. Two bullets in a bag. Two cannibal midgets in a fat guy's red cage. Apologies, but when Claptrap speaks, I feel my brain cells committing suicide one by one. I shall be out directly. A pleasure to meet you, Bolt Hunter. I am Sir Hammerlock. At your service. I came out here to research the bully moans for my almanac, but Captain Flint's men trapped me on this glacier. Many thanks for disposing of them, by the way. To survive a direct run into Handsome Jack and defeat Captain Flint's bandits, unheard of. I'm headed to Sanctuary myself. From what I hear, the Crimson Raiders there could use a hero like you. Now, if you could hand me the robot's eye, please. Now, I need only connect this to this. That should do it! Ha <laughs> I am alive! Oh dear, he's talking again. Megan! Now I've got my eyesight back! And you're far uglier than I remembered! Time to join up with the Crimson Raiders in Sanctuary! This glacier's full of nothing but murderers or jerkbags! Like that hammerlock dude! I'm standing right here. Dude. Now that Lyersburg is cleared, I might as well turn on the main power. This town's full of things that may be of use to a go-getting slayer of men like yourself. Minion, roll out! I see our fearless leader Jack is looking for it. Charming fellow, isn't he? Spouts drivel about bringing peace to the frontier, then shoots unarmed men, women and children like it was going out of style. Ah, I'm spouting exposition again, aren't I? Apologies! You. Ah, fecal matter. The bounty board's broken. The resistance must have disconnected it before they left for sanctuary. I'd planned to post some jobs for you. Ah, well, just speak to me instead. Though, Captain. Thank you. In Lyersburg, I see no reason that wild bullymong should lollygag about the place, disrespecting the memories of the former townsfolk. If you could clear the town of them, that would be most gentlemanly. The objective's on your hut. Change your active mission. You can change your active mission by using the mission log in your Echo device.
achievement if anyone in Liasburg were still alive to celebrate your victory, but still, well done! Hello, mercenary person. I have money and a problem. Greetings. Do you feel you have too many bullets, but not enough money? about raiding peaceful cities in the future. Hopefully. Thank you. 
station. You can use this to change your appearance and reset your skill points. Please make Captain Flint's death as prolonged as possible, would you? If you're to survive out here for any length of time, you'll need a bit... Shield, I humbly suggest paying a visit to the old Crimson Raider safe house. You'll need to take the elevator up there. You can buy from me! I'm always happy to drink... Your money.
the train that runs through the dust. If all goes well, we should get to Sanctuary in a day's time. Hyperion hasn't diverted any troops from New Haven to pursue us, and a sandstorm has devoured their nearest frontier town. His audio logs. She was a lieutenant in the Crimson Raiders, the anti Hyperion resistance. I'd be very interested to know what became of her. If you could find the rest of those audio logs, I would be more than happy to pay you for them. Mrs. Pierce and break my heart. This train doesn't belong to you, so why don't you turn around and face me, Pumpkin? This train was commandeered legally under the... Holy nutballs! <laughs> what happened to your freaking face?
How about this? Lady, I don't even know what to call you. You tell me why you look like you headbutted a belt sander, and I'll let all of you go right now. My husband gave me a skag pearl ring. The pearl released hunger inducing pheromones. Oh, you know what? I am so sorry. I, I just forgive me. What where's your husband now? He's dead. That is a heartbreaker. But you got something in common with him now, at least! Handsome Jack killed her, did he? Shame. A real shame. Please return the echoes to me whenever you are capable of doing so. Greetings. Do you feel you have too many bullets, but not enough money? Flint and I had a gentleman's agreement in the past. I give him the loot from the bodies Jack ditches in the glacier, he promises not to torture me for hours at a time. And he does it anyway. But that ends today. We're gonna take him out, steal my ship back, and sail to Sanctuary. Is that job I sent you on going? Let me know yes, when you're done with that job. Happen, Is that job I sent you on going okay? My first mate, Boom Boom. Let me know when you're done with that job. Jack's gonna pay us, and I'm gonna play hopscotch in your chest cavity. Be careful taking down Boom Boom. He's one of the Ripper clan, as in Flash Ripper. I don't have to tell you why they're called that. Hey, how did, how did Buckle suck? How's your day been, buddy? We haven't really talked much since I left you for dead. Hey, you think you'll freeze to death out there? No, probably not. Bandits will get you first. My day? Been pretty good. Just bought a pony made of diamonds. <laughs> 
Yeah, <laughs> because I'm rich. So, you know, that's cool. Goodbye. Protect me, Squire! <laughs> Don't hit it, I'm sorry! You're gonna 